Hola, I came Multimedia fans, Alex Rivas here, and welcome to Salsa Percussion Loops. When I was a young producer, I had a client that came to me and he wanted me to produce a salsa song for him. And at that time, I didn't have the preamps, I didn't have the microphones, I didn't have the instruments, I didn't have the studio, I didn't have the musicians to record a live percussion, which is very important in salsa music. I tried to find samples and loops online and everything I found was sounding old and updated. Years later, I had a professional recording studio with the tracking room, with the preamps, with the mics, and I decided to produce salsa percussion loops with the sound that I was listening in the radio and using my expertise as a Cuban born and raised producer. To make possible something like this, I carefully choose the musicians that I wanted to use and actually the gear that I wanted to use. The musician, they had to be from a salsa country. What I call a salsa country is a country where people breathe and live salsa music. Don't get me wrong, there are more than three countries that people love salsa, but in this case, I choose Cuba, Venezuela, and Colombia. Those are the countries where the musicians that record salsa percussion loops are from. Salsa percussion loops were carefully recorded with the top of the line preamps and microphones. We use preamps like API, NIF, Avalon, Universal Audio, and also we use microphones like Sure, Sennheiser, Melly, AKG, Mojave, and others. Salsa percussion loops were recorded in three different tempos or BPM. They were recorded in 95, and 100, and 105. These are the most common tempos in salsa music. You will get verses, pre-chorus, chorus, cha-cha, reggaeton, Cuban bomba, so you are covered pretty much in any part of the salsa song with any situation that you may be facing in a songwriting session or producing session. I hope you enjoy Salsa Loops as much as I did making them for you. Thank you for being here. I can't wait for you to try them. Adios.